Jamie Foxx is a clone. You heard me right. This new Jamie Foxx y'all been seeing out here is a clone. At least that's what conspiracy theorists want you to believe. All right. And I love me a good conspiracy theory. I do. But notice I said good conspiracy theory and cloning celebrities just ain't a good one to me. Y'all, I don't understand it. See, when I think about a reason for cloning people, I'm thinking some diabolical plan to to manipulate people or manipulate the world around us. And I just can't see it with the Gucci Mane. I know they were like, nah, they clone celebrities because they have so much influence. Then why? I, so because Gucci Mane went to prison, right? And Gucci Mane represented all the negative stereotypes that they place upon black men, right? And you want me to tell you, tell me the real Gucci went to prison and then the clone Gucci came out and he started eating better and taking care of himself, dieting. Uh, he squashed a beef, a long time beef with another black man and started making money with him, became nonviolent, married his lady, started having children, holding his wife and his family at a high regard for the public to see. What are they trying to influence his followers to do? Who wrote that package? Who is responsible for the new Gucci package? Martin Luther King? What sense does that make? How does that, if anything, can we get more rapper clones? Can we get a couple more? I can think of a few niggas that can undergo the clone package because I'm starting to like the cloning niggas' ideas. They they are great. They're great. And, and, I, and now I'm thinking about the Jamie Foxx, you know, clone situation. So... Jamie Foxx, right, had a health issue, right, and he was away from everybody. And since he came back, he's helped the lady save her purse, saw relaxing on a yacht, and having fun with people at Top Golf. Oh, diabolical! What are they doing? What are they doing? <laughs> and what is what is this new Jamie up to? Out here living life. In a good way. Wait a second. I, I get it. I get it. But I, I want to understand why this is, why you would clone Jamie Foxx and it can be considered a bad thing. Because if Jamie Foxx had a health issue that took him away from us and we would lose the Jamie that we love, you mean to tell me that this diabolical system decided to give us one of the greatest talents we've ever experienced back to us? And I'm supposed to be mad about that. This nigga can sing. He can dance. He can act. He can, he can do impressions. He can do stand-up comedy. He's a great host. And we were going to lose all of that. And they said, hey, man, we'll just give them back to you. And I'm supposed to sit at home like, I don't like these clone niggas, man. I don't like it. I don't know. So far, them niggas is two for two for me. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe maybe that was the plan, <laughs> to make the world a better place. That's what it was.